Over the weekend, Lauren Gray opened up to her millions of followers on both TikTok and Twitter, sharing her experience with sexual assault in a powerful and heartfelt post. What's up, y'all? I'm Emil Ennis Jr. here with Clever News, bringing you all the latest news updates that you need to know, and Lauren Gray is speaking out. Lauren Gray is known across social media for her epic glam, her music, and her TikToks. Her social media posts are always bright, positive, and silly, but on Saturday, she opened up and got serious with her fans about her past experience with sexual assault. And before we get any further into this story, I just wanted to give a trigger warning and let you know that we are going to be talking about some heavy topics in this video, so please Please only continue watching if you feel comfortable doing so. We also link some resources down in the description in case you or someone you know needs help. You are not alone. Okay, so Lauren first posted her story on TikTok, sharing with her fans that quote, when I say you have helped me more than you know, I truly mean it. And she started off her video saying, I want to tell you my real story. As the video went on, Lauren shared photos of her younger self and shared her journey with her 43 million TikTok followers. She wrote, quote, this is me over five years ago, not long before my 13th birthday. At this time, I had my innocence stolen from me in the basement of someone I trusted. I only told one person, and to this day, she remains my best friend. We cried in my bathroom together for hours. Lauren went on to reveal that, quote, I struggled to put the pieces together as to why this had happened to me. It took two months for me to finally tell my parents. I felt dirty, hopeless, broken, and worthless. I was confused and scared. I felt like it was my fault. She then went on to explain how the incident continued to affect her as the years went on. As she started to shoot the fame on social media, Lauren said that she found a lot of joy in connecting with fans, but she also received a lot of hate, which led to further shame. In her TikTok, she said, quote, I was homeschooled and began making videos to pass the time and ease some of the loneliness and isolation I had felt. People were watching my videos, and although I was still struggling, I felt like I had finally found people who cared, regardless of my situation. Although every now and then, the comments and questions would be too much. She looks like a whore. Are you a virgin? And at the end of the video, Lauren revealed why she decided to share her story now and how she hoped she can help at least one person. She wrote, quote, I was always afraid to tell people my story, fearing people would view me differently and I would lose those I cared about. I'm 18 now and I've realized that my past does not define me. It was never my fault and I never deserved it. I came out stronger and I'm so proud of myself. There is light at the end of the tunnel and if my story can help even one person, then to me, it's a story worth telling. And many of Lauren's fans flooded the comments of her TikTok with love and support and gratitude for her being brave enough to share her story. One fan revealed they got emotional watching her video writing, this brought me to tears. You never know what someone's gone through. You're so, so strong, Lauren. Another chimed in saying, this is heartbreaking. I'm so sorry this happened to you. You're incredibly strong and I'm sure telling your story will help many. We love you. And another fan sent Lauren Love writing, love you, Lauren, you are so strong, such an inspiration to many young girls, including me. Others also shared their own experiences and thanked Lauren for making them feel more safe and comfortable, like this fan who wrote, this helped me. I'm going through the same thing right now and it feels good knowing it gets better and I don't stand alone, so thank you. And after receiving all the love and support, Lauren took to Twitter to thank her fans and reveal why she decided to share her story when she did. Lauren said that she was actually being blackmailed with her own traumatic experience. She wrote, just wanted to say I'm sorry for not being online much today. It's been really difficult for me to share this part of my life in such a public way. I received a message that somehow someone knew, but I know how fast word travels and I wanted to be the one to tell my story. And while we can't believe that someone would even be so disgusting and blackmail Lauren with this experience, she managed to find a silver lining in sharing her story. And we're glad she got to tell it herself. She wrote, quote, I'm overwhelmed by the amount of support and love that I have felt today, but it also breaks my heart how often this happens. Although I was forced to grow up quickly and lost a part of me in the process, I wouldn't change anything about my life. Every experience I've had has taught me something. Although I hate that I felt forced into sharing this prematurely, I have no regrets because I am no longer ashamed. And Lauren also explained that she decided to post this message to fans in text form because it's still hard for her to talk about out loud. But she ended her post by thanking her fans and sharing how much their support has meant to her both now and over the years. Lauren wrote, quote, I started making videos to cope with the feelings of isolation and loneliness. My life truly changed when you all came into it. For the first time, I had felt love, as if my past had been erased and no longer defined me. So when I say you give me purpose and helped me through the darkest times in my life, I meant it from the bottom of my heart. I hope this can shed some light on the gravity of sexual assault 
and provide some hope for anyone who can relate. Love you all so much. Thank you for listening. And we already know sharing her story has definitely already made a difference. So thank you, Lauren, for your bravery. We're sending you a virtual hug and feel free to please share some love and support for Lauren down in the comment section below. Also, just in case you missed it, Lauren recently made an appearance in a Taylor Swift music video. Click right over here to see what she had to say about that. I'm Amelia Junior here with Clever News. Bye guys.